Uh, this morning, now moving on, Desiree is live at a, a new home decor store with some pretty unique items. Anything that uh, kind of fits your fancy that you kind of see, hey, I'm going to grab that, Des. Yeah, there's some really great stuff inside the Frank Lloyd Wright store here in Scottsdale. And right now we're joined by Mark Johnson. He is the retail manager here at the store. How long has the store uh, been here in the community? Oh, well, the Quite some time. Yeah, the store <laughs> opened in the 1980s. Kellyus and West started in 1937. Okay. So, yeah. And we're here talking about a new partnership that you have with some local artists bringing us some great products. Mm -hmm. Let's go through the line here uh, and talk about them. Okay, well we're going to start with our rain chains, which are right over here. And these are made by a local artist named Terry Welch. And she used to be a fixture on the local festival scene, which hasn't happened for the past year. So this partnership has been very valu valuable for her. Um, and we're pulling stained glass from some of Frank Lloyd Wright's designs. And then we have stones, you said, right here? From stones from the our desert. desert, the stained glass. You can see the stained glass panels. He has a legacy in that kind of work. Mm -hmm. And um, around Tellius and West, you'll see objects, decorative objects hanging from the eaves. Frank Lloyd Wright called them icicles. So that makes sense for us to carry these rain chains. Yeah, those are beautiful. And then here we have a beautiful scarf here also, obviously, in, inspired by Frank, Frank's uh, designs. That's right. Blaze Danio is another local artist, and you'll see her murals around town. Um, you might recognize the color palette. But this is a design she came up with based on the stairs at Talies and West. Mm -hmm. And then next we have the wood puzzle. The wood, speaking of the stairs, here is a um, original painting by Carson Bilger, a local artist. And he also volunteers to teach art at our summer camps here at Talies and West. And we've used that image on a number of projects, uh, products including the wine stopper, mm -hmm. which every mother needs. Yeah. Mother's Day, great and gifts. And a mom needs jewelry always. Jason Catlin is a local um, silversmith, jewelry artist. These um, pieces are all based on objects that are found in our cabaret theater. Okay, and last but not least, you've even made us coffee uh, this oh, morning. Oh, help yourself, Thanks. yes. This <laughs> is um, from Calvin Heiser at Loving Earth Pottery. Um, this is a Lungo-sized cup. We just made a fresh lungo for you. And um, he's incorporated our whirling arrow, which is um, our logo logo here at Talies and West, mm -hmm. inspired by petroglyphs that were found on the site by Frank yeah, Lloyd Wright. Beautiful. And you mm -hmm. also do, really quickly, we, we have to wrap up, but you do tours as well during the week. Tours all week. Seven days a week. We're open 10 to 4. The store's open 10 to 4. If you don't have a tour, you can come shop. Okay. Um, but tours run every hour. All right, mm -hmm. great. So lots of options here ahead of Mother's Day. <laughs> Plenty in the store. Just beautiful. Those cups Thank are so cute. Oh my goodness. They're like oh, so yeah, sweet. They're beautiful. Can you buy those in a set? Mm -hmm. Can you do they come in a set? Oh, you can buy a set. Yes, sure. he said absolutely. <laughs> you can buy a set whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, mom would love that. All right, Des, thank you. They're so beautiful. And a piece of artwork, Troy, right there in your hand that you can yeah. drink every morning. Isn't that nice? You know, you're sipping your coffee and you do it out of something like that. Maybe it takes a, makes the coffee taste a little bit better. Who knows?